Greetings. 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 My beautiful beings of light. Do you feel the energy pushing you up my beloveds? From this point forward my beautiful beings of grace you will continue to spiral upward at warp speed. Your pre-incarnation intention was to begin the ascent along with all the other planet Earth inhabitants, that includes all, down to the tiniest speck of matter, since all has consciousness even the air that you breathe. Mother Earth is ascending with you my beloveds, right on schedule. You each are in different places my beautiful beings of love so don't worry or compare yourselves to others. You are exactly where you are supposed to be. You each are moving in divine perfection with your own master scripted plan. Take a deep breath, you are spiraling upward, take your angel's hand. Ascension my beautiful beings of light is about personal growth upward on your own individual spirals of evolution. Pre-incarnation you each planned and created your master growth scripts for these very special moments in now, along with selecting the day, hour and minute of your birth including the day, hour and minute of your transition from the earth plane. Many of you actually created more than one exit point so that you would have a choice. Do you remember this, well of course not, which is exactly the way that physicality works. The veil of forgetfulness allows you to experience things, as if they are happening for the very first time. You may have had the same lesson in the preceding past 20 lifetimes but you will not remember those events because of the veil of forgetfulness that is in place. This allows you another opportunity to make a change in some pattern that you have chosen to rise above. All is in divine and perfect order my beloveds, you are right on track and right on schedule. From here the road may appear to be all uphill, so stop and take a breath and a get a drink of water. You are spiraling up, take your angel's hand. Your angels and spirit guides are the perfect companions for this adventure. They have only your best and highest interest at heart. They know what your master plan contains and will work with you to fulfill your scripted experiences with ease and grace. Ease and grace by beautiful beings of light does not mean a cakewalk with no effort on your part. It does mean that following divine guidance will assist you in walking through experiences with less resistance. Where there is less resistance there is less frustration, pain, and anxiety. After all you scripted a circumstance that you wanted to experience in the physical. Take responsibility for what you are experiencing. The lessons are there because they were requested by the you that you really are. Working with your angels and spirit guides is so very beneficial now for helping you move forward. Everyone wants to know what is to come. There isn't one answer that fits everyone, as you have each written plans in conjunction with the Divine Master Blueprint. If you take into consideration that there are 7 billion plus humans along with all the other various kingdoms in residence within planet Earth including Mother Earth herself and each has a separate divine and perfect outcome in all of this transformation. The answer that would best work with all involved is to take each moment in now one breath at a time, and focus on what is there for you to experience. Walk through that, experience with your current tools and inner spiritual guidance and then move on to the next moment without expectation or requirement on your part. The one shining constant that is always there from one moment to the next is that you are loved unconditionally by the Creator and that will never change. This same one constant holds all of creation together and it is the divine source of all and unconditional love for all that is the unifying source. Allow this messenger to take you on a mediation journey to remember how to erase the doubt that you might have. Sit in a chair or lie down whichever is your preference. It's time to be comfortable and undisturbed for a while as you journey within yourself through meditation. Close your eyes and take a few deep breaths in and out. Visualize with each in breath, you are breathing in love and renewal. With each out breath, you are breathing out pain, fear, frustrations and doubts. With the last out breath feel your body relaxing. Allow and give yourself permission to feel the calm, peace and serenity of this safe place. My beloveds ask your ego self to perch on your left shoulder. Instruct your ego self that it is only to be an observer on this journey, it is not to participate. Through prayer to the Creator please ask the Creator to share with you a translucent golden shield of light. Visualize it all around you forming a bubble from head to toe protecting you from all outside influences and giving you warmth, radiance, light and power. 
negatives will simply bounce harmlessly off your shield of protective light. My beloveds, the Creator has responded to your prayer. Your protective bubble has been supplied. The energies for this bubble will continue to flow from the Creator, cycling back down through you again, and back to the Creator in a continuous circular loop while you are in meditation. You are now divinely protected at this moment and nothing can even communicate with you, that is not for your highest good, without your permission. Breathe in deeply my beautiful beings of light and sense the lighter relaxed feelings of being divinely protected and guided into this meditation. Breathe in deeply and know that you are breathing to the pulse of the Creator. Breathe in deeply allowing, seeing, and sensing within your spiritual imagination your guardian angels and invited spirit guides as they join you now. The angels take your spiritual etheric essence hands and guide you out of your physical body. The angels then direct you into your etheric spiritual heart chakra. An angel is staying with your physical essence until you return from your meditation journey. My beloveds, you are visualizing, seeing, feeling and sensing this within your imagination, your guardian angels, spirit guides and special invited guests are with you now within your spiritual heart chakra. Your angels and guides are helping you locate the golden door that says to my highest guidance within. In your imagination you have located the golden door and now you turn the etheric spiritual door knob, opening the door as you cross over the threshold knowing that you are on a spiritual growth adventure. You find yourself in a white marble corridor. Your angels take a quick look at you to make sure you are looking your very best today. They then lead you out the swinging doors to your right. Hum you say to yourself you have never seen these swinging doors in this corridor before. The door label said to the creator. Your angels just smile and tell you that you weren't ready to see the swinging doors yet. They laugh and tell you that there are many things in the corridor that will only appear when you are ready to utilize them. The universe works on a need-to-know basis my beloveds. On the other side of the swinging doors is a giant pink spiral. It looks very much like a huge pink spiral staircase going up into the celestial realms into infinity. You notice that it is automated and doesn't require any climbing work on your part. The angels do confirm that yes that is the way that this spiral operates. Your angels tell you that today you are going to level 14 with a quick stop over first on level 7. Walking over to the spiral you see that there is a stop button on the spiral operational panel that the angels push to halt the upward spiral so that you may climb on. You hop on and then the angels start the spiral again. You begin rising at a very comfortable pace. You are feeling completely at ease and very safe and secure. You are just enjoying the ride. You can see off in every direction from this vantage point and the view is breathtaking. You do have a moment of deja vu in that you remember this spiral from somewhere. Oh your angels are laughing now, they tell you of course you remember this, you have done this before hundreds of times. You just nod your head and hope to confirm it for yourself again by the end of the journey. The brief stopover comes at level 7. You step off at level 7 and in front of you is a large blackboard with the word doubt written in white chalk. The angels step next to you and ask if you doubt that the Creator loves you unconditionally. You think about this for a moment and somewhere within this essence is that tiny smidgen of unbelief. Your angels ask if you are ready to erase that from your memory banks. The angels then ask if you are open to receiving and allowing this deletion to free doubt from your reality. You answer yes. The yes answer then illuminates a cord from your essence connecting you to the word doubt on the board. The angels tell you that this is a two-step process. First the cord must be cut and then the word doubt must be erased. You nod your head in confirmation. This messenger takes the blue flaming sword and severs the cord. Immediately you see the cord vaporize right before your eyes. Then this messenger hands you the eraser. You quickly take the eraser and remove the word in one swipe, sending chalk dust everywhere. Doing a little quick scan of your essence you notice that all traces of doubt are gone. Your angels are guiding you back onto the spiral and turning the spiral back on. You begin your further ascent up into the heavens. Before you can think to look around you have arrived at the 14 level. The spiral stops and you step off into what appears to be an enchanted forest. In the grove of trees you notice a brilliant light. You begin following this messenger and your angels and spirit guides. 
it's just a short walk and you hear music all around you. The music is very very familiar. You begin humming it to yourself. The melody feels very soothing and you feel yourself moving back into harmony and balance. Arriving at the center of the wood you notice a huge dance floor has been assembled and right in front of you to greet you is the Creator, its immaculate self. The light is so glaring but your spiritual eyes quickly adjust. The tears of joy just begin to roll down your face in remembrance of deep unconditional love and joy. To be in this presence is more than you could ever describe in words. You know this embrace. You know this song, this is your song that the Creator had specially prepared for your initial birth into the celestial realms. The Creator reminds you that yes you will remember now, that you were birthed into the celestial realms long before you were ever off incarnating into other life adventures in various places within the Omniverse. This is your permanent home. This all feels so good and so true. You confirm to yourself that this is indeed so and visiting home is wonderful. The Creator asks if you would like to dance, just as the two of you have danced eons of times before. The answer is yes. 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 And away you go dancing across the floor allowing the Creator to lead and you just meld completely into the Creator. This feels divine and in perfection. The Creator tells you how much you have been missed and how much you are appreciated for all of the work that you have done. You are dancing to a slow rhythmic waltz, that is your very own song, twirling and turning and whirling about with the source of all creation. You feel the love all encompassing you and sense a profound peace that you've not experienced in such a long time. The joy and ecstasy is indescribable. The Creator reminds you of your promise to complete your mission and you nod your head in confirmation that you will finish your work on the earth plane. You tell the Creator that you are not sure if you will ever want to go back to planet earth once this assignment is complete. The Creator acknowledges your concern and asks for you to wait until this incarnation is complete before placing conditions on your celestial essence evolution. The Creator reiterates that much must be completed before any future growth assignments are discussed. You know in your heart that is true. The Creator reluctantly tells you that for now it is time to return and finish your work. You thank the Creator for the dance and the opportunity to check in and remember yourself as the you that you really are. The dancing slows and stops. You have one last hug and disengage. The Creator reminds you that you can check in any time now that you have remembered the way. You wave and agree that you will daily connect. Your angels lead you back to the spiral and the angels push the button for your return. Before you can even blink an eye you instantly find yourself back in the white marble corridor. You catch a glimpse of your brilliant essence in the mirror. Your angels lead you back across the threshold of the golden door within, back into your spiritual heart chakra and then they assist the return of your spiritual essence back into your physical form. Take a deep breath to help you reorient as you wiggle your fingers and toes. When you are ready open your eyes. Go about your day remembering that your inner higher wisdom and angelic support staff are always at your service working with you to help you reach your highest most appropriate potential. Listen for those first thoughts that pop into your awareness and know without a shadow of a doubt that you are receiving daily spiritual guidance. Beloveds you are blessed beyond words and loved beyond measure, more than any earth plain language can ever express. I am Archangel Michael the Creator's messenger, of love, joy, wisdom, light, peace, and grace.